Okay, so I thought I would uh, do a better video and show you the problems that I'm having. As you can see, I've got um, uh, a Mac 2.8 quad core with 10 gig of RAM in there, so nice and fast, nice and fast. Uh, I've got uh, addictive drums installed. Um, obviously, I've got this set up right for uh, actually bringing the instrument in, and as you can uh, hear that, it plays superbly. Yep. Um, and on here we actually have it uh, mapped to the uh, Explorer everything works okay apart from this is the problem that we're having this is a kit obviously you might not be able to see but it's on uh, it's on MIDI these are the right way around um, opposites so that they actually work correctly um, and when we come here as you can hear, the sounds they are actually registering on the addictive drummer. So what's the problem? Well, this is the problem. Where is this now? Fine. Let's see. And if I keep tapping, there's no registering of the uh, audio. It's almost like I have to leave a gap. Now it works. If I do it quickly, it won't work. Now I'm not too sure what the uh, uh, correct MIDI settings is. Not going to show up on the on the iPhone. Oh, there it is. Uh, I'm not actually sure what um, settings I should be using on the um, actually in here. If there's anything that I'm I'm not you know I've, I've not set up right. Um, I mean, I, I, I'm not sure about all these, whether these are correct or whether I should change these. So if uh, anybody can help me uh, and tell me why it's doing this, um, please let me know. Because it's, it's, it's really frustrating when you, you buy a kit and you buy the software and then uh, it doesn't work. So there you go. See if you can help me. Thanks.